Hello again there, you two fans. It's the Creepy Doll Man here. I'm back with an all-new episode. It is December the 26th, 2017. Time is now 1.52 a.m. Okay, before we get into this, the Creepy Doll Man has to apologize. It was supposed to release this episode exactly after midnight, after the Christmas episode that he just done late tonight. Now he just finished and wrapped that up. It's up and loading on. Uh, it's uploading on YouTube now, but it's not finished. Uh, I expect these episodes won't be finished on time, on all three, because I'm doing instead of a Christmas special, I decided to release. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna leak it out now. I'm doing a double episode. So that's right. The creepy doll man is stating there's gonna be another episode behind this. So you see it and you see it up on the. Or deal with the dates actually the same, meaning if it says December the 26th, 2017, which would be 12 26 of 2017, then you know that's a if you see it twice, then that's a double episode. So keep your eyes out from that because the creepy doll men don't lie. And I'm also apologize it took me that long to clean up my mess, as well as I had to eat to take my final snack to take my final Crohn's medicine. And I just finished, it took a while. And what's going to be is now that I'm going to get into this right now. Today's topic is on this doll. In our communications, in our investigations with both me and Creepy Ghost Hunter Jr., we found out this female spirit is named Elizabeth S. Now, we asked specifically, and we got very little details about how, you know, Elizabeth uh, S truly live uh, she claims to be black African American and there's other little details that kind of was sort of disturbing when she told us uh, she claims that someone put a voodoo curse on her meaning using black magic is either a voodoo priestess which is a female or it was a male priest and we don't know who put the curse on her but she claims that she was cursed before she came over here on the boat that she calls the death boat. And there's a lot of story about that. It's going to be a controversy on this story, what I tell you. She came over here on a boat. Uh, it was not a normal boat. It was actually a sleigh boat. Now, the slaves back then in the early days were brought over here to be sold and, you know, used as house servants in the American so I'm sure she was smuggled over here in early times in America to become a slave. And sad part to say, she probably never made it over here as a slave. Uh, because we didn't get her year right until after we did get the year right. But we, at, we didn't ask the age and we forgot, so her age is unknown. Uh, she claimed that while being on this death boat, she died, I guess. I'll give a theory about that later. But she died in 1408. I don't know how she died too well, but Creepy Dollman has a theory how she died. So let me tell you a couple of theories that might have happened. Now, when she was brought over here on the boat she called Death Boat of Slavery, uh, it's possible either the captain or one of his hired hands that, you know, was, you know, taking the slaves over here might have accidentally killed her, probably by mistake, or deliberately beat her to death. Who knows how she died, but she had died probably a violent death. And in panicking, the captain might order his men to throw the body over the boat, and she probably end up either in the river or in, in uh, probably also could have end up in the ocean before she made it to a river. Smuggle here, smother, excuse me, smother here in America. Now, the second theory is that the creepy doll man thinks that she might have tried to escape, and by doing so, she tried to jump over the boat, but not realizing that she could probably not could swim right because the water was probably too shallow, and she might have hit a certain water where she couldn't swim, and she might have got pulled under. Or that maybe she couldn't swim indeed and she decided maybe to take her home her own life in order to become 
free from being a slave. So that is the creepy doll man's theory. And if anybody believes the creepy doll man's right, please comment back on this theory. Uh, now, I apologize again that I was supposed to release this episode before midnight. I am sorry. But, you know, that that's just how it is. Uh, things don't go the way you plan when you do these episodes. And plus, since I don't have no, you know, internet here, it makes it kind of hard. Without Wi-Fi, it makes it even harder to download these at a faster speed. So, it takes longer because I have limited data. And that's why the smartphone takes forever to upload them. So, Creepy Doll Man apologize. Now he says to all his YouTube fans and all his non-YouTube fans, please subscribe today to the Creepy Doll Man to see further new episodes to come. And this is the Creepy Doll Man saying goodbye and God bless you all.